is sponsored by <laughs> Children's Hospital of Richmond at VCU. The doctor is in and you have questions. When kids participate in sports, injuries are bound to occur. Today, Dr. Shanette Davey, an orthopedic surgeon at Children's Hospital of Richmond at VCU and former Division I athlete, woohoo, is here to share some information on the expert care Children's Hospital of Richmond at VCU offers. Good to see you, doctor. Great to see you. Thanks for having me. So you ran track at VCU, is that right? I did. I ran track in high school and as well as VCU. This is, this is my alma mater. I've also coached track and field in high school. Oh, right. So you've, you've seen both sides of the track, uh, the, the coach side and the athlete side. Uh, kids run into injuries in all kinds of sports. Uh, one of our sons was injured in wrestling, got a concussion in wrestling. And you don't think of that, but it does happen, doesn't it? It does. It definitely does. I definitely have an inside perspective on sports and sports injuries and wanting to get back in there. And um, understanding the mindset of athletes as well as the demands of sports on their bodies. It definitely is hard trying to get back in there, but there are important steps to take that need to be taken to ensure that this occurs safely and without further injury to the body. That's where my education and experience as a pediatric orthopedic surgeon come in. Well, we think of football as far as injuries, but it's not just football as we talked about before. What kind of injuries are, have you seen? You're absolutely right. Contact sports often come to mind first when people think about sports injuries, and we certainly see plenty of those. But we also see injuries in other sports such as soccer, baseball, running, dancing, you name it. We see it. We see ACL tears, meniscus tears, broken bones of many types, strains and sprains and dislocations. The purpose, uh, sports can definitely impact many parts of the body, but primarily the joints and usually around the elbows, the hips, knees, shoulders, and ankles. Yeah, and a lot of attention needs to be paid to that, and obviously that's where you step in. Why is it important for kids to get care from a specialist in pediatrics? You know, kids' bodies are still growing, and they're, the treatment that we do now can affect how they grow their muscles and bones grow as they get older and how it functions. And so as pediatric orthopedic surgeons, we receive extensive training and experience in diagnosing and treating these injuries. With children, we always have to be concerned about the growth plate because at the ends of the long bones of the arms and the legs, there are open growth plates. These are made up of cartilage and eventually solidify and turn into bone when children get around teenage years and um, and a little bit older. These growth plates are the weakest parts of the bone and are more prone to injury. So we have to be careful how we assess and treat these so that they don't have long-term problems. It's important for all kids, especially serious athletes, to seek treatment from a pediatric trained team, such as our team here at VCU, because unlike adult orthopedic surgeons, we care for kids all day long. We offer same-day orthopedic care in our children's pavilion here at VCU, Monday through Friday. And if it's after hours, they can be seen in our emergency room and as well on the weekends. You know, it's interesting because with kids, everything is different and kind of scaled for them. I'm reading a, one note you sent me here that uh, x-rays for kids, a lower doses of radiation. And, you know, if, as a layman, you wouldn't think that would be the case, but it obviously is. One last question for you. Advice for parents to help kids avoid sports injuries. So our biggest advice is, uh, well, my biggest advice is to make sure that kids are getting time for free play as well as time to rest. And this is especially important when children are the younger age group, say seven, eight, nine, even up to 10 years old. I think there's a lot of pressure these days for kids to specialize in one sport, especially at a younger age. And so this can lead to a lot of overuse injuries, which we're seeing quite a bit these days. Also, I think it's important that we listen when a child tells you that something hurts or they look like they're in pain. Kids will often try to tough it out, but there's no point in making a child tough it out because this could lead to further and more potentially serious injuries. 
I want to thank you so much for being with us, Dr. Davey, an athlete herself. For more information on the Children's Hospital of Richmond, give them a call, 804-828-2467, or visit online at chrichmond.com. Stay with us. Virginia This Morning will return in just a few moments.